who are going in for the first time, our Director of Nursing, Mel. Mel, after you. Oh, okay, thank you. Come in and we'll show you around. Here's the main reception area. Our community will come in and they'll be greeted wonderfully by our staff and there'll be a seating area over here near the cafeteria. One of the big design elements has been all of the open space, the glass, and how this looks of a night time in particular with the lighting. So this is a really airy, special space for our community to feel safe, well looked after, and they know that they'll get expert care here at Roman Hospital. Come through and I'll show you our ambulatory care area. This is really important with integrated care and contemporary modern models. Not everybody stays in hospital anymore. So through here, we do specialist outpatients, lots of facilities for our families, our parents. Uh, we would be looking after mental health services, uh, surgical services when people are coming in for their pre-admission clinics, and also specialist medical services and other visiting services will be seen through here. Come on, I'll show you one of the rooms. Let's show you down here. our full furniture and fittings in yet but you can see there's lots of space to see an individual person and their family members and an area for staff to have their notes and their pathology and other information as they're looking after a person and we also have uh, the ability to do telehealth so we can link into specialists in Brisbane and other areas across the state and also Australia telehealth is a huge part of the services we'll provide moving forward here in our state-of-the-art emergency department, we've got four bays for our acute care, two resuscitation bays fully equipped, and an area where we can use isolation, and also our key partners, Queensland Ambulance Service, coming through and helping us transfer patients as needed. Again, fully equipped with telehealth, and 24-hour emergency response through to a state-of-the-art centre in Kedron in Brisbane. We are in the well-anticipated birthing suite. We've got two beautiful rooms for our families to birth in. Come through and I'll show you. We've got the reception area for families to be greeted. So still being put together, but we've got a lovely area here for family to be with mum and bub and through here a well equipped area for the process to be undertaken based on mum's choice and what she would like for her birth plan. Our midwives and our staff are really excited about being able to welcome the next generation of Maranoa residents into the world. One of our lovely two bed bays for close observation, just across from where the nurses will be doing their main work. We've also got a lovely area here for our patients and their relatives to come out and get some over there. This was a deliberate part of the design initially um, when we consulted with the community around health and wellness and what makes a stay something that little bit more special. So here's one of our general patient rooms. Really beautifully fitted out with uh, some area for families, but really excitingly, we've got an outside area for rehab and getting people ready to go home. Purpose built design with different floor surfaces as people would have at home, but also just a lovely breakout area for families to come and get away from what might feel like a bit of a clinical environment. We think this is really special and you'll see the bottle tree design on the, the wall over there, which really represents uh, Roma's piece of difference. Not very often we get the privilege of looking in a theatre if we're not being a patient or having surgery. And new theatre suites. And our recovery area. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that quick sneak peek of the new Roma Hospital. We're on track and ready to open towards the end of the calendar year. We can't wait to welcome you. This is a really big milestone for Southwest Hospital and Health Service and we know our community will get the integrated modern care that they deserve. Thanks everyone.